All right, we're leaving our, our uh, newfound Gap Hilton. Oh my God, Ugh, everything's gonna have to be washed. <laughs> I smell like bathroom people. The park ranger came up here this morning. He was no help. He can't give us a ride. He yeah, he even... laughed that we got stuck in bathroom. Yeah. Not an intentional laugh. It wasn't like a <laughs> But it was like a <laughs> the guy said he's sleepy last night. <laughs> <laughs> what a jerk. I don't think it was intentional. Well, at least we get a little bit of a view on our road walk. We are heading down to Gatlinburg. It's about 15 miles. It's on the road though, so hopefully uh, we can make it a little quicker since it's flat. It's already go through this tunnel. called free hiker therapy. <laughs> ah! Did I do another? Yeah, another. Okay. Oh. Almost slipped on that ice. <laughs> 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 ah! <laughs> Almost slipped on that ice. Gut hooks. Add this. Alright, recommendation for gut hooks. If you're making a um, road walk 15 miles to Gatlinburg, excellent water sources. There is not that bad. No, that's because it's not that bad. We literally were taking icicles off of the side of the like rocks here on the road. Lunch time. Look who rescued us. Our good friend Oso. All right, good morning guys. It is uh, day 25. <laughs> Five. <laughs> and we are in Gatlinburg. Yeah, I think it's just like the phone, like if you're not holding it, it makes the other person look like they're bopping around. Anyway, it's day 25 and we are in Gatlinburg doing a zero. This is actually one of the places that like before we headed out on the trail, we said we wanted to zero, but that's because we wanted to go to Dollywood. And by we, I mean me. I feel like it's my birthright given my name. So unfortunately they're closed for the season. Like everything, like everything else. else we plan to do <laughs> out here. So um, yeah. So instead now we're, we're just going to breakfast. <laughs> zeroing. <laughs> And we're going to breakfast right now. We're supposed to go meet Oso, which will tell you the story of how we caught him later. Um, but they've been there for a while, so they might be done when we get there. But in uh, John and Amy's videos from last year, they recommended, a, I swear it was a 5,000 calorie cinnamon roll, but I don't know, maybe it was a thousand or something anyway. I've been dreaming of that since we got on trail. So I asked Amy where it was, she let me know, and now that's what we're getting for breakfast this morning. That's the place we're going for breakfast, with a huge line, dang it. So we'll probably be waiting a while. <laughs> Alright, here it is guys, jumbo giant cinnamon roll. 
cheese grits, hash browns, pecan waffles. That's cinnamon rolls, all sugar, so I ate a little over half of it. Thomas, of course, ate all his food. That's how you get the name Dinner Bell. Hey guys, check out the AT today. I'm just kidding. It's a nice this little grab. Gatlinburg Trail. Gatlinburg Trail, two miles from Gatlinburg to the Sugarland Visitor Center, where we are walking for free to go get our guidebook stamped. So we're walking two miles there just to stamp our guidebook. <laughs> we're gonna walk two miles back, but I wanna show you guys what the trail looked like and let you guys know that uh, we've realized we kind of have two running themes, right, of our hike. And the first one you could probably guess, which is no views. And the second one, Thomas, you wanna tell them about the second one? Second one is doing pointless miles. Pointless miles. Like how we walked like six miles on the road yesterday, and <laughs> point six miles to the Gooch Gap Shelter, Gooch Mountain Shelter. No, you're talking. <laughs> that was not Go Gooch Mountain. It was Woods Hole. Don't listen to him, people. Woods Hole, whatever. And point three miles up to Shuck Stack, where there weren't even pancakes. Straight up, straight up. That's beautiful. There, colors aren't that great in my camera, or maybe it's because I have sunglasses on. I'm not sure which. Anyway, so this is what we're doing with our day. And I uh, still gotta make you guys that food video. Yeah, we got a lot to do. We gotta do laundry, we gotta do food. Laundry, busy, yep. busy. You know, with Oso and yeah. Yeah, hopefully we'll get some video with Oso. Oh yeah, while we're here, let's go ahead and tell him the story of how he caught up to Oso, right? All right, there, a better camera angle. Oh, you guys can see the trail and us. So clean. So clean. So clean. How we caught up with Oso. That guy's taking four zeros in Gatlinburg. That's how we caught up with Oso. <laughs> it was nothing we did. It was all him. <laughs> it was 100% all him. No, he, he got off trail for the night. His friend came up here with his truck. All of Oso's gear, he needed to switch some stuff out. They ended up going to one of these restaurants here. So this was Wednesday. He met him up here Wednesday when Oso got off trail. And then what? Thursday, he was supposed to get back on trail, but wherever they ate Thursday, they got pretty sick. So Thursday, he decided to stay one more day to kind of- Feel better. Feel better, yeah. And, and then Friday, uh, the road closed. They closed the road. <laughs> so he couldn't get back up. And then Saturday. And then, so by, well, by Friday, his wife decided that she was gonna come up here with the kids. Yeah, so they got up here last night with the kids. So he was like, well, I'll stay till Monday. And we said, we wanna hike with you, so we're gonna stay till Monday too. And so, uh, Monday will be tomorrow, so we'll be heading out tomorrow morning. Yeah, yeah. And I think I already told you guys, but maybe not, Alex, the girl we've been hiking with, she pushed on, so she'll be out of the Smokies today. And uh, she might rejoin us. She's gonna take at least one zero. But she might rejoin us after. Snuggles has moved on to bigger and better things. No, I'm just kidding. We love you, Snuggles. Uh, he's got some friends he wants to hike with and stuff, so he's kind of flip-flopping where he's staying right now with um, this section. And he'll come back and do this section next week. So we might catch up back with him in, you know, next week, but, um, or two weeks or something, I don't know. But we'll, we'll see him again eventually. I'm sure that's how things work out here. But we're gonna hike with Oso for a while. And uh, we're going six days to Hot Springs. So you guys can catch us in Hot Springs. Next week. Next week, yeah. For another zero. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Maybe where we have three themes going on. <laughs> we also like De Niro and Zero. Yeah, like it's Zero. fun. These towns are fun, right? Like if you don't want to spend your money, don't go to town. But we do want to spend our money, so we go to town. That's why we saved our money. So we That's can why spend we saved our money. our money, so we can spend our money, just like you said.
All right, we are headed back from the visitor center where we have a running theme here and our experience was less than positive. So uh, yeah, probably my first, last and only trip to the Smoky Mountains because we've had an awful experience and uh, we're having an okay time in Gatlinburg. Definitely the place, definitely the most expensive place, lots of touristy stuff. And other people have said this before, Gatlinburg 100% does not cater to hikers. They don't need to cater to hikers. So if you've never, if you've been here, just keep on moving, like don't even waste your time. For us, we were stopping here anyway because it was a place we've always wanted to come. Just wanted to hop on, tell you guys, three out of 10 would not recommend coming to Gatlinburg on your uh, hike. So yeah, I'm gonna stick with my three out of 10, would not recommend. Y'all keep moving. <laughs>